Hi, so I depotted a couple of my blushes. Um, I did some MAC blushes already, but I didn't film them because I know that you can see these done online a lot. Um, and it was my experimentation. Um, I did, uh, this is Melba here, something special, and this is Lady Blush. These two are creams. Actually, um, they came out okay. As you can see, they are a little warped <laughs> from prying them out. What happened is with the creams, once you do them on the flat iron, they heat up. So they're liquid. You have to put them off, let them uh, cool down, and then prime them out. But the glue kind of hardens at the same time, so I had a harder time getting these cream blushes out. Eh, they work, though. They're usable. Melba came out super easy. I did the same thing, heat, and then just pried out with my um, <laughs> stitch pick and uh, my little screwdriver here. So that came out pretty easy. You can definitely find some videos, some blog posts on those. So I did not film them. I apologize. Um, I did actually do a Tarte blush. This is Tarte Exposed. I love this blush. It's amazing. Um, Tarte comes out really easy. I said I'd show it, so here it is. There you go. At the back, I already took off the sticker because I've done this already. At the back, there is this little hole right here. All you have to do is something tiny, sharp, poke in the hole. Look at that. Popped right out. I'll do it again. Poke it in the hole. Pops right out because it's magnetized. Tarte blushes are magnetized. I actually peeled the sticker off and uh, put it on the back of this so I can remember what it is. Throw that right in my Z palette because they are magnetized, which is great. You don't have to use a magnet on them. There you go. So this is just a large palette, actually. Um, right now, just so you can kind of get an idea of what fits in the large Z palette, uh, blush-wise, um, I have three MAC blushes, the Tarte blush, there you go, but, and the Tarte blushes are a little bit bigger than the MAC blushes, but there's not a lot of room, like I could probably only fit one, two, like maybe four more blushes in here, I fit one here, three more here, I, I don't know, for me, I love blush, I have way too many blushes, I wanted to fit them all in one, I don't think I'm going to be able to, so I'm probably going to have to buy another uh, palette. I mean, I can fit some in another, like my eyeshadow palette, but I kind of want to keep them separate. I have my Luminizer too from the Balm Mary Lou, which also fits if you want to see the size difference there. Yeah, a lot bigger. So I am a little undecided on what I'm going to do. I think I'm going to try to just put my Balm blushes in here, but I also have Benefit uh, blushes that I want to depot. So, we'll see what happens, but I will show you anyways. I'm going to leave that for now, my large Z palette, and I'll show you what I'm going to depot blush-wise as a reminder. So, I have uh, Down Boy from The Balm. Super cute. <laughs> Adorable packaging, but whatever. I want to use it. So, there we go. They're a little bit bigger, too, actually, than MAC. A lot bigger size comparison so I don't even know if I'm going to depot I have a three in this size if I, I can even fit them in there we'll see I might put Tarte back in the original packaging because it comes out so easy either way there you go that's what I'm going to do I'm going to depot uh, Down Boy by The Bomb I'm going to depot Frat Boy Blush by The Bomb I'm going to depot Cabana Boy <laughs> blush by the bomb. And I'm going to depot Hot Mama by the bomb. Oh, there we go. Which is a different size. So I might fit this one in with my shadows. We'll see. We'll see. Have not yet decided. Um, benefit, what I'm going to do, um, depending if I have room or not, I think I'm going to do them anyways. I have Coralista that I'm going to depot, which actually the size comparison between these two, if you have them, you know, but otherwise, Balm is bigger. Coralista is a little smaller. We'll see. Coralista is like the size of MAC, but square. There you go. 
And then um, also by Benefit box powder, I have um, Dandelion. Oh, which is different even. There you go. So, uh, I think that's all that I'm going to depot. I actually have a MAC domed blush too. Um, warm soul. Awesome. But, domed blushes do not fit in regular Z palettes. So don't depot your domed blushes and domed eyeshadows unless you have the domed Z palette. You have to buy it specifically. I was going to buy it. This is the only domed product I have, so it was would have been a waste. <laughs> of course, in my mind, I'm thinking, hmm, buy more domed shadows, domed blushes, so you can buy the domed palette. Yeah, I'm a smart girl. But anyways, Warm Soul, I have, you can depot these uh, big blushes. They say you can't, you can. I've seen videos, I've seen people say no, 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 and then I've seen videos showing exactly how to do it, and they come out really easy. So as long as you're careful, you can uh, depot your domed blushes and domed shadows too. So anyways, that's it. I'm going to get going on, I think I'm going to do the balm blushes first and see how that goes and then possibly work my way to the uh, benefit blushes depending if I have room or not. I think I will do them anyways. So stay tuned. <laughs>